Welcome to the Fleet Cars demo. Uh, my name is Ray Rowan from the Contact Center Specialist Team in the EU. And this demonstration is to highlight the speech capabilities of the Avaya Experience Portal in identifying and verifying a customer. The call flow is to, uh, for the customer to say their registration number or their account number um, in alphanumeric. Uh, so because it's not numeric, it cannot be entered in DTMF, so it needs to use the speech recognition capabilities on top of Experience Portal. After that, we'll verify the customer, either using their date of birth the first time around, or more accurately, we'll even use their, their voice print, their, the voice biometrics of their voice the second time around. Uh, and lastly, we'll show personalized service for a particular user around uh, a reminder for them before they're transferred to the agent. When they are transferred to the agent, all their context information is passed through to that agent, including their registration number and their verification status. So now let me conference in the IVR and, uh, to start the demonstration. Welcome to Fleet Cars. If you're a new customer, say, new customer. Otherwise, to handle your call, I need to know your vehicle registration plate. Please speak your number plate now. CZ61AMB. Your license plate is? CZ61AMB. Is that correct? Yes. Great. I found your vehicle details. What is your date of birth? The 2nd of February, 1972. Thank you. You've now been verified. Please note, your next service is due on the 28th of February. To confirm the notification, say accept. Otherwise, say decline. And I'll put you... Thank you. Please wait while I transfer your call to one of our fleet service specialists. Experience Portal now transfers the call to the agent, which will come into one X agent on my desktop, uh, which isn't visible on Scopia. Uh, but when I answer the call, I should receive a, a screen pop around the information. Here we see the registration number, that I entered in earlier, and the verification status. So let me drop that call uh, to the IVR and have a look where we are on the PowerPoint. So we've gone through the call flow once using date of birth as the verification. Now let's go through that again, and this time we'll use voice biometrics to prove the customer is who they say they are. Um, the, I, I've rung in previously and registered my voice print against a particular license plate registration number. And this time I'll say that's that registration number and I will we'll be able to verify my voice print against my previous saved uh, voice print. So again, please hold while I conference in the, I, the experience portal. Welcome to Fleet Cars. If you're a new customer, say, new customer. Otherwise, to handle your call, I need to know your vehicle registration plate. Please speak your number plate now. DK61CIC. Your license plate is? DK61CIC. Is that correct? Yes. 
Great. I found your vehicle details. I now need your verification phrase. After the tone, please say, my voice is my password. My voice is my password. Thank you. You've now been verified. This is a reminder notification that your car is due for service on the 3rd of February 2015 at 3 p.m. To confirm the notification, say accept. Otherwise, say decline, and I'll put you through to one of our fleet service specialists. Accept. If you want. Thank you. Please wait while I transfer your call to one of our fleet service specialists. Again, we see when the call comes through to the, to the agent, the agent using Monarch's agent gets a screen pop with the information, the context information passed through from Experience Portal in through Connect Center Elite to Monarch's agent. And in this case, it gives the new uh, registration uh, number for this customer. And again, it gives the, the verification status of that customer. So any information can be passed through that mechanism to uh, Monarch's agent. So that's the call flow. Um, to see how this was developed, we can look at uh, Orchestration Designer, the, uh, the, the call flow development environment for Experience Portal. And here we see it. Uh, it's, it's a built-in, it's a plug-in for Eclipse. We can see the call flow here, starting with a welcome, then getting the vehicle registration number, then going through a verification stage, and then lastly, a notification stage. And then it jumps from there down to the bottom left where we set the context. In other words, we take all the information about the vehicle registration number and uh, the verification status, put that into the UUI message, which goes across uh, when we hit the transfer, goes across into the contact center and presents to the agent. We can see briefly on uh, the Experience Portal Manager Um, that when we log in here and look at the applications, we can see as we scroll down through some of these applications that these two applications that, that we worked on today, the Fleet Cards Date of Birth 1X Agent application uh, has a steering code of 144806. When I dial that number, it goes through, the, through to that application. The other application we used was Fleet Cards Voice Biometrics 1X Agent, uh, which has a different uh, steering code uh, or, or dials number. Thank you for attending the demonstration today.